<laughs> Good evening, everybody, and welcome back to the Angry Cast and the Return of Minecraft. Uh, I guess good morning, more by the looks of that compass or the uh, clock over there. Anyways, uh, yeah, um, things have, uh, it, it's been a little bit of a long time since we did anything. Uh, we've been kind of hunkered down in the cave because of the pandemic. Uh, so we really haven't, uh, haven't really gone outside. Oh, well, and so we can go see what's, uh, what's happening in the halves over here. Uh, took a long nap, a little bit of a hibernation, if you will. Uh, but we're gonna go catch check out and uh, see what new things have, have uh, come across. There's a, there is a new update. There is a new update. Uh, you know what it is? The 1.16 update. The Nether update. Huzzah! And that means we've got to go back to the Nether and do some more work there. But let's go check and see what has happened uh, since we've been quarantined. Uh, in the cave. Uh, what's, uh, where's my peeps at? Oh, there's a guy over there. Yeah, let's go say hi. He, he looks a little pale. He's a little winter is just a little bit, uh... Oh my g Gee! Ha! Hey! Uh, you got a little, um, right on your, your, um, yeah, no, um, hmm. <laughs> okay, what the hell happened? How long was I asleep? Is this the future? Are you guys, is this like the, the, the time machine? Like the Morlocks and the Elo Eloys? What, what's going on here, people? What the oh. <laughs> oh my goodness, the texture pack that updated with 1.16 did not do you guys any justice at all. What the hell? You look, it's like fishmen up in this bitch. Wow, uh, maybe we should just <laughs> continue along and um, go check out the, oh my god, look at it. Like, look, return to the sea, dude. Let's go check out the, the book and, and, and see what uh, we have uh, for us, so. <laughs> no, I swear to God, I'm not. I'm no. I, I swear I'm not looking. I'm not looking at all. I swear to you, I have. N okay, fine, fine, just fine. Let me get in there and read the book. Come on. Okay, mm. dude. Seriously, I know you want me to read the book. Get the hell out of the thing. I can. There you go. Dear Mongo, we understand that there was a need to be socially distant, as the mushroom virus, also known as COVID-19, was pretty horrific. Oh God, who writes this stuff? Oh wait, that was me. Uh, but while you were hiding out in your cave these past few months, not doing anything to build us up town, something terrible has happened. Wait, what do you mean, something terrible? Wait, better, better yet, what do you mean not doing nothing? Uh, I was doing a lot of things. I will show you what I did, Mr. Man. We will go look at all the things that I built for you in the entire time that we were on lockdown. I spent a good three months putting in a lot of hours, blood, sweat, and sweat, uh, blood, sweat, and tears into building you guys, um, building you, um, I built, I built a wall. I built a wall. That's all I've done as I built a wall. Okay. All right. Fine. You get that one. I'll give you that one. You're allowed to have one. Everybody gets one, Peter. Everybody gets one. And you are still trying to kill yourself. Anyways, uh, okay, fine. Just, you know, stop being an asshole. Let's just, let's just throw away all of this. Anyways. Uh, so, wait, uh, there we were... Okay, there we go. There was an eerie light coming from the tower over in the woods. The humming of that portal grew to be a very loud and obnoxious roar. Then nothing. One of our more curious citizens... Can you not back me up, dude? One of our more curious citizens, Ned, wanted to check it out. He went over to the tower and, and then never returned. Well, that's rather ominous. Uh, Ned has always been a bit of a curious... Well, you stop pushing me. Ned has always been a bit of a curious sort, always playing with ingredients and things and trying to be some sort of a wizard, but this worries us. Luckily, another villager followed him and saw Ned. He saw him fall from the platform towards the lava. Oh, God. Oh, oh. Well, I hate to tell you this, but uh, Ned's dead, baby. Ned's dead. I Well, I, I can't back that up. I don't know for sure. But let's just continue on and, and see if we can figure out what the end of the story holds for us. Because I'm... I've, okay. Uh, but he did not die. He landed on the back of some strange creature and floated towards the shore, where he disappeared into the sulfur-laden mist. You must go retrieve him. He is the only one that can make a good drink around here. Signed, us. P.S. Wear a mask. Look, I'm telling you right now. Hey, look at me. See, I'm wearing a mask. I've got my mask on. You're the one that's not being socially distant. You're getting up on my grill. You're not being six feet apart. So take that, you, and, you, and, and you've got a third eye in your head. I hope you know that. Anyways. Uh, yeah, so we've got, uh, <laughs> we got a quest to go retrieve Ned from the nether. And I, apparently I've lost the trap door somewhere, but it, no matter. Uh, we got we to gotta go do this thing here, and this is... 
going to be let's I tell you what this is this is creeping me out we need to change the texture pack here hold on a second oh much better you look wonderful you look beauteous all right much better than the third eyed demon we just saw earlier anyways okay uh so we gotta go to get another we gotta go find Ned it's the quest to find Ned uh I wonder how my bees are doing how y'all doing there guys uh, we're still doing stuff that's good that's good uh we have enough food we have enough uh we have some tools hopefully this will just be an easy walk through the nether to find uh, Ned and uh, we can get back to doing what we gotta do. Um, so let's uh, let's get down there and take a look. Uh, there's some new sounds I can tell with the uh, the footsteps on certain and well we're caught on this cobweb. All right, uh, we'll, we'll be back. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Here we go. Finally into the Nether. Oi! Whoop! Whoa! What is? Uh, where is? Where's all the the stuff? Where's my 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 little? Shelter I had built in my my um, ramp my walkway where I mean everything I how do what is that down there how the heck what, what is going on um let's I can't see anything let's let's up the distance here so we can see the the land uh, that's mm, that none of that looks familiar um maybe I'm facing the wrong direction maybe it's the other way let's just I don't want to go back to the other oh there we are okay that looks a lot better yeah, well I mean not better better but yeah, um, let's, uh, okay, we're gonna have to go back and, uh, get some, uh, uh cobblestone. All right, all right, all right, I'm, I'm kidding, kidding aside, this is what's really going on. Of course, we have to do this for the story of the narrative, you know what the narrative is, what we're doing. It's the quest to find lag, and the 1.15 update was, uh, was helping us out do that, and now with the 1.16 update, uh, we've added a new element. So I did take a lot of time off because I was waiting for this update. And in doing that, I knew I was gonna have to do something drastic, uh, as such as reset the, the nether, because there was no way, no way I was going to be able to continue on with uh, the update with, with as much of the nether footprint that I've already created. So I went into the app data uh, folder on my computer and I deleted uh, the DIM1 uh, and there's also there's two DIM one. They're DIM one and DIM dash one. One is a folder that handles just another. One is another folder that just handles the end. And I deleted one of those, backed up my game, and then reloaded it. Uh, and then this is what happened. It resets the nether completely. Here we are with uh, having to rebuild all this. So we're going to just do this real quick. We need, we need to get on. But I want to give you a, a, a quick overview. Well, maybe about 10 minute overview <laughs> of, of what has changed with 1.16 and how it's going to affect us going forward. Uh, I don't have a lot of time to devote to a lot of this and I apologize. I know I'm a bad huge whoop, YouTuber, but uh, yeah, that, that's that's where we're at. So let's uh, let's start to show you what the new things are that have changed with 1.16. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Okay, so here is what has been changed in 1.16. We have got some new biomes. There's, first of all, there is the nether waste, which is what the nether used to be. Uh, actually, well, what is now the nether waste used to be what the nether always was. Uh, there's also the uh, warped forest and the crimson forest, which are dense forests with huge crimson fungi. Uh, fungi. Uh, they also contain nether warp blocks and fungi found in, in patches, as well as these weeping vines. Um, there's a fog effect, and there's a different color into the atmosphere of the nether waste, uh, the, um, than the nether waste biomes. There's also the soul sand valley, which is basically covered in soul sand, and so it will be hard to walk across. There is basically skeletons uh, and gas abound, and endermen can be there. It's going to be a dangerous place to go. Make sure you can use ranged attacks. There is also the basalt deltas, which is basically like a volcano. Uh, in the nether. It's got these big huge pillars of basalt and large areas of the stuff called black, blackstone and the air is going to be gray. Uh, you're going to find a lot of gas and magma cubes there and striders may spawn there as well. Next up we got some brand new mobs that have been introduced in 1.16 all in the nether. Uh, there is the hoglins which is basically uh, a boar, uh, think pumba on ketamine. Uh, they're very hostile. They spawn in like the Crimson Forest and a couple other places like the Bastion Remnants. They will drop pork chop, a raw pork chop and leather, unless you cook them with a, a uh, you know, a bow or uh, something with fire. Uh, there is an adult and a baby variant, and they can be bred, but they are going to be, uh, they will be, uh, they will attack you. 
<laughs> um, they are hunted by the adult uh, piglins, which is a further ver you know down the road there. But and they will also convert into zoglins if they happen to show up in the overworld or in the end. Uh, you can avoid placed. They will avoid uh, areas with uh, warped fungi, nether portals, and respawn anchors. Uh, next up is the zoglins, which is basically just a zombified version of the hogland. Um, that's what happens when they when they come into the overworld or the end. Uh, they cannot be bred, and they do not flee from warped fungi. They will drop rotten flesh, and they will attack most of the mobs on site, except for creepers and other zoglins. They take more damage with Smite, and it is considered as an undead mob. Uh, next up, the Piglins. The Piglins are pretty much just pigs in leather armor. They spawn in the Crimson Forest and Nether Waste. They are pretty, 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 pretty uh, hard to kill. Uh, they can spawn with a golden sword or a crossbow. They are hostile, uh, but the babies versions are passive. Now, if you are wearing at least one piece of golden armor, they will not attack you, but they will turn aggressive if you mine a block of gold or you open up a chest uh, in their in the vicinity. Even if you're wearing the gold armor, armor, uh, they will subside after a while, but it's going to take a bit. Uh, you can barter with them while they're passive, meaning if you're wearing gold armor, and right-click with them uh, a gold ingot or drop an item on the ground, it makes them drop a block uh, in return, or an item in return. They will attack adult hoglins, and uh, they can, they can uh, the baby version can ride on the back of the hoglins, and they will attack the wither skeletons on sight. They will avoid soul fire, soul torches, soul lanterns, soul campfires, the zombified version of them, and the zoglins. They will spawn with golden armor, or they can, I should say. And if you go and bring them up into the overworld at the end, they will uh, turn into a zombified piglin. Now, the zombified piglin itself is just basically what has replaced the zombie pigmen. That is, uh, that is what has become the zombified piglin, and I don't think that they uh, will attack you uh, in the nether, they, unless you attack them. We got some brand new structures in the nether. Uh, there are things called the basalt pillars, which is basically a floor-to-ceiling pillar of basalt that generates usually in the sand of uh, the soul sand valleys um, There is the huge crimson and warped fungi fungi. I keep saying fungi. I don't know why the fungi basically giant mushrooms that are warped They're blue or red. They've got creeping vines on them uh, Basically, this is the wood of the nether if you happen to uh, chop them down. They are made of the crimson and warped stem blocks as well as nether warp blocks and warped warp blocks, uh, which resemble the leaves in the overworld. They can be grown from their respective fungi. And these are the trees that we're gonna be using for a lot of our uh, new structures we're gonna be building. There, next is the nether fossils. Uh, basically, this is the fossils like in the overworld, except they're above ground, they're easy to find. They drop a bone block. They are different because uh, they, they're different from the overworld fossils because they generate can generate random pieces of basalt instead of coal ore. Um, but they are easy to refine, and they are if you were looking for the uh, fossils in the overworld. Uh, also, there are ruined portals, which are shattered remains of nether portals. They generate in both the nether and the overworld. Uh, they can be buried underground or underwater, and a loot chest can be found right near them. Lastly, is the biggest thing that is going to be a a, a thing for us to check out, like the. Uh, nether fortress, it's going to be the Bastion Remnants. The Bastion Remnants uh, will generate in all of the nether biomes, except for the Basalt Deltas. There are four types of the structures. There's a bridge, there's a stable, there's housing units and a treasure room. They are the only source to get uh, a new uh, music disc that we'll, uh, we'll talk about in a little bit. The Piglins and the Hoglins will spawn there, and there are spawners that can spawn magma cubes and uh, in the uh, Bastion Remnants. And piglins have more gold armor par uh, parts if they spawn here versus if they just see them out in the wild. I am not going to spend a lot of time on this next list. Just run through it here. Go check out the wiki. Ancient debris is the biggest thing we want to find because it is uh, the source of the netherite. However, it's in lava. It's going to be hard to find. We need a good pickaxe, the diamond pickaxe. Um, anything else is pretty much... Uh, oh, the lodestone is a pretty important thing because it's going to have the ability for us to uh, mark a waypoint in the nether. Uh, other than that, that's pretty much it. Everything else is, is self-explanatory. Soul campfires. Yeah, it, good stuff. All good stuff. There's new ways to do fire. Awesome things. And then lastly, the items in 1.16. The lodestone cup is a big thing. Works with the lodestone block to point you back to a, a place other than your spawn point, which you can't have in the nether other than 
uh, you know, bed will blow up. The music discs are not that big of a deal. The netherite armor and the netherite tools, those are the big thing because you have got to use diamond armor and diamond diamond tools, and then you add the netherite to them to make them. They will still take enchantments. We're going to have a kick-ass set of armor that's barely going to touch us, and then we can really do some damage either here in the nether, in the overworld, the end, wherever. Unfortunately, I just died, and we'll have to uh, continue on. Crap! All right. Apparently, I did not also have my microphone on for the better part of this video, so hopefully I, I can remember all the things I said and re-record the voice and make it not sound too horrible. In any case, there is where we want to go, I guess. That's a different, a, a different biome of these, these new biomes that we have. First of all, let me re-equip re all my gear. Okay. Alright. Uh, this is, I believe, this is the Basalt Delta. Is what this is. Uh, let's see here. I brought some more food. Just in case. That's cookies. Okay, Basalt Deltas, yes. Mm -hmm. oh. I wonder if Fortune, I'm going to check the Fortune to work on this. So that, oh, new recipe, that is Blackstone. You know, this is the 80s, Blackstone Magic, remember that. Oh, look! We finally found a, uh... Ooh, we finally found trouble. We finally found a fortress, another fortress. We couldn't find one before. We finally did now. Oops. Oops, okay. Come on, guys. Alrighty. Haven't been able to f haven't found a fortress before now. There's a lot of shit here. This is pretty pretty bad. Oh boy. I don't want to get involved in any blaze fights right now. Oh, but there could be some treasure. That would be good. Oh, that would be awesome. Oh. I certainly don't want to get weathered. Oh. That was pretty good. Look at, listen to the sound these things make. Holy cow. Did you get that? No. Alright. That's pretty damn amazing. Okay, how about that? So yeah, Basalt Deltas are pretty interesting. Uh, basalt Deltas deltas are just pretty much the same thing as other diet. There's nothing really out of the ordinary. I mean, you do get to see a pretty pretty cool effect of having a um, nether fortress appear in one. But other than that, it's not like you're going to get anything out of the ordinary from... I'm seeing this. There was, you know, we, we do have somewhere around here. I think I saw on my way in. I thought I saw uh, one of the like, Crimson Forest or whatever. And that would be interesting because that's got some of the things we really want to find. And those are the, the trees. But we got to get around. I love the new sound, the new ambient. Oh, there is a. Oh boy. That's not good. But we need to kill him. We need to do. We need to kill him. Fairly simple, but he didn't drop a blaze rod, I bet. No, he did not shoot. We're going to have to find it. We might as well, while we're here, look into this. This is something we need to do. Well, going in, I guess. Ned, we'll find you, don't worry. Oh, that's definitely, definitely, yes, I'm glad we came here. I'm glad I didn't do that, but... Yeah. Yeah, we went... We have not had any way of uh, actually producing any potions yet, and we're going to need some potions for our fight when we eventually find lag. 
find whoever took them. Oh, oh. Shoot. Okay, I forgot to hit record. Uh, I managed to get my stuff back, but I am not in a good place right now. This sucks because I had 42 levels. I had 42 freaking levels. And one of the things that has changed in 1.16 is that... <coughs> Um, I don't know whether I can hear them. <clears throat> One of the things that's changed in, in 1.16... Hold on, I gotta turn down the... Unless I'm outside looking at stuff, I want to keep the resolution so, it, so the frame rate doesn't drop to, to shit. One of the things in 1.16 is that the... Um, fishing, the AFK fishing <laughs> thing doesn't work anymore. Oh, oh well that was dumb. <laughs> so yeah, that was stupid. So yeah, the AFK fishing uh, thing that would get me all the XP and all that stuff no longer works. They took that out, so now I have no way of of getting uh, all my ben mending books and all that stuff, which sucks because I really wanted that. Oh my goodness, look at all that stuff. Ned, where the hell are you? see you. Where the hell are you at, dude? Let's dance. Oh, right. we gotta find our way out of here. I don't even want to talk. I'm like so, so distracted by everything. Oh, hello. Is there any? Okay, there are no hoglins around. Well, that might. Oh, okay, that's not that great. Uh, lag. So yeah, it's 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 a whole different game, and the Nether has become more scarier than ever. I mean, the Nether didn't used to really be that scary, and now all of a sudden it is. Thanks to some new biomes. Who knew? Who knew how easy it would be to make the nether great? Make the nether great again. <laughs> uh, we gotta get out of here and find another biome. We, we got much to do in so little time. Oh boy! Obviously, we haven't found Ned yet. He's not going to be here. Let's go look somewhere else. Somewhere a little less uh, dangerous. Ooh. Okay. Alright. We got away from that thing. Let's, where are we at now? Back in this. 
this is what the nether now looks like. I mean, the old nether. Um, it still has the old... It's called the nether wastes now. It's not the, uh... It's not like it used to be called. Which was just straight up nether. But, you know, it, it's still a biome in and of itself. But it's now surrounded by the other biomes that are new. Which is, uh... Oh, there's one of them there. This, I think this is the Crimson Forest, is it not? I believe so. I think it's the, uh... Can I find a way... Can I find an easy way up here? Oh my goodness. I think we need a silk touch. Or we're not going to get anything good. Yeah, it's just going to drop. Straight up another rack. But if you had a silk touch... Oh! What is this? This is a crimson fungus. So yeah, this is the crimson forest, and that's some crimson roots. Uh, you know, there there's a tree. This is what we're looking for. This is definitely what we're looking for. Uh, we want to definitely get a tree, a sample of this. Um, we could use this for building. This will be awesome. I have got my inventory is all full up here. That's not good. Oh. What is that? Oh. What is that? Uh, what can we drop? What can we drop? We can drop... Uh... What is that? What is that? What is it? That is a shroom light! Okay, that's, that's a good... One of those things we talked about. So, let's, uh... Let's... Can we... Bone meal. Awesome. Do some inventory management here. Uh huh. All right. We can get rid of our cobblestone now. I don't think we need the cobblestone right now. We did all we can do with that. Let's. I don't have. A, I should have brought a damn. Uh, let's do that for now. That'll help us out a little bit. Not. Oh, not much though. Uh, one of these swords, just no, I don't care. Oh dear. Hide behind the trees for now. Oh, we don't need that. We don't need that in a coal. Must have come from a... So, yeah. Okay, so, we will find all this stuff. We'll come back and we will do an exploratory uh, mission to get all this stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna get out of here. I'm gonna start digging through the hole. Digging through the war. Oh dear. 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 Okay, we're gonna start digging. Digging through. A, digging a hole here. Here we go. Okay. Whew. Okay. There we go. Oh, hello. Hello. Where we at now? Where's this go? More crimson forest. Yeah, oh yeah, oh, okay, yeah, more comes in force, oh, oh yeah, okay, <coughs> so yeah, the crimson forest, they, the, um, the, the trees, they're not trees, they're crimson, uh, they're, they're fungi, they're, they're basically, they're mushrooms, and those things are weeping vines, and they will, uh, the interesting about, thing about them is that they, like other, you know, unlike other vines, they grow up, and I think you have to, I don't know that they grow up on their own, you may have to use bone meal or something to make them grow, grow, and they will, uh, they will grow up, so they, they kind of like, they work like vines, but they grow in a different direction, in that sense. But, uh, they also, the shroom lights are good for, oh, these are hoglins. Oh. Shh, Pumba, no! No, Pumba. Bad Pumba. Bad Pumba. Oh, my. Uh, that, the other rack. Raw pork chops. Good thing. Drop some raw pork chops. Oh, and some leather. Can always use some leather. Okay. 
Uh, yeah, you. Uh, I thought they wouldn't attack you, but I guess they will. They're the only thing that's going to just straight up attack you. I, I, I didn't think they would attack you, but they do. Um, oh, and look at this. We're right next to a warped force as well. Same thing. The warped force is, is the blue version of the... Uh, oh, there's uh, you know there's another one. Another one. The, um, you need silk touch to pick up some of this stuff, as always. But I, I wish I want to get the the wood, although I don't know that you can do the wood, anything with the wood. You can make planks of it, so we, we... I don't know that we can grow them. I don't know how you would grow them. We have to figure that out. Um, but I'd like to grow these to make the wood to make more... I'm not wearing any pants. How about that? Um, to make more building materials for us to have uh, for our our town, for, you know, some of these buildings. I mean, you know, they're... The... the oh, my. This is... Oh, that didn't sound good at all. The um, denizens of our town are going to be a little bit more... Oh, how do I want to say? They're going to be... They, they know I they know they got a guy that can get stuff. So they're going to want to say, you know, we're not going to just have the... Oh, my goodness. What was that noise? They're not going to want to have the regular stuff. They're going to want to have the goods. Oh, that's what it is. Oh, my goodness. It's a hog one. These damn warthogs. They're going to want to have the good stuff. They're going to want to have me, you know, build with these cool materials that are, like, you know, kitschy and... And, and new, and I might need a better... Let's do this. This might go better. There you go. Should, you know, bring them back and show them what we got. Uh, once we find Ned. Uh, in order to say, hey, guess what we... You know, there's 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 cool new things in the nether you can see and do, and you can build with, and, you know, we'll, 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 we'll do all that. Now that, I, now that it, you know, we sort of passed on the... Uh, uh, social distancing at the uh, in, in our world, we can... We can start to, uh, re you know, get back into doing things. And I'm totally not being truthful in that statement because there's no way I'm going to have time to do anything. <laughs> but we'll try. We'll, we, we, will, we will give it our best college try to uh, get back into the swing of things. There's too many things going on. I mean, if you know what we've been doing, watching the series, is we've played The Last of Us, and I've been back into other things, and I haven't had really a lot of time. I mean, Skyrim is winding down. I think I've only got like two more episodes left by the time this comes out. Um, yeah, going to the uh, going to 200. I thought that was a good place to stop. And oh, do I have another? I don't have. Oh, this is bad stuff. We gotta we gotta find Ned and get the hell out of here. Okay. We'll have to work our way through this. Find the next, uh, find the next biome, and hopefully, if we find Ned. Oh, this is gonna take forever. Whew. Okay. Uh, what? Why are we here? Oh, okay. This is a bash, uh, a, ba a bastion remnant, and this is the, uh, the only structure you're gonna find within. Oh shit! Why are they pissed off at me? Why are they Why are they mad? Oh dear! Why are they mad? Why are we mad? Shoot! Why are they so mad at me? These are not... These are not... These are not zombie pigmen. If we are wearing it... Okay. There we go. There we go. Hey, dude. Oh. Whew. So, yeah. So, um... Piglins. Piglins. Hoglins are the, are the warthogs. Piglins are the... Are these guys, and they are hostile to you. the adults are hostile to you no matter what, uh, unless you're wearing something of gold, some gold armor of some sort. So that's good. The good thing to know, we can come and we can come and go in here as we please, as long as we're wearing something of gold. 
So, and you can also trade with them. We're, we're not here to trade. We're here to find. We're here to get just shitty with the. Uh, uh. <laughs> now, see, if I open up these chests, I'm liable to screw everything up. So. Oh. Oh. Hello. <laughs> I think because I'm wearing the gold armor, I'm okay, maybe? Apparently, I'm, I'm good if I don't open up anything or touch anything. They'll stay up aggroed for about 30 seconds, but they'll be fine after that. So, ooh, the damn, the damn lag. It's ridiculous. Oh, jeez. All right, all right. Ow. Ow. That hurt. I thought I heard something. Hi, dude. Um, I'm thinking, though, I could get around the whole problem with the with the uh, chests by using a a hopper, and that would work. If I use a hopper on these these bad boys, it sucks it out, and really have, don't have to touch anything. So, God, how are we gonna? Listen, we got we don't have a lot of time left. I mean, I don't have much left in this axe or this pickaxe. We have yet to find Ned. I have no idea where I'm at. 180, uh, where are we at? 188? Alright, uh... God. Hey. Ooh, hi there, buddy. Oh. Alright, uh, ooh. 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 Uh, there we go. Um, hmm. Oh, 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 the chains, that's right. Ah, uh, shoot. I wish I could take this stuff. Take those chains. Um, uh, hmm. Hmm, okay. Uh, uh, how do we get out of here? Uh, okay, this was my hole I was digging, and I started looking around. Uh, oh, ooh. I still got my gold pants on, I got a gold shirt on. They shouldn't bother me. Okay, they seem cool. All right, um, we gotta, we gotta find, we gotta, we gotta find it. What are they looking for? What are they looking for? Oh God! Oh, what was that noise? Oh shoot! Oh. Ow! 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 Oh. oh, oh, No, no. All right, uh, let's try this again. What are you all looking at? What are you trying to do? He's up there. I don't know what's there. All right. I heard him. I heard him. I heard him. I hear you, dude. I hear you. I'm coming to get you. Oh, the cork pork chops. <laughs> Alright. I hear you. Oh, shit. What's that noise? What, is it you? Ned! <gasps> Ned! There you are. <gasps> oh my god, Ned. We gotta get out of here. How am I gonna get you back to the portal? Come on. Let's go. We gotta sneak out. Come on. We gotta go. No, no. This way. This way. Ned. 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 Where are you going? 
Ned, Ned, please. No, not that way. This way, this way. No, where are you going? Come on. Oh, this is going to be a... No, we got to go this way. Got to go this way. Let's go. 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 Ned, Ned, what are you doing? Come on. Move. Move. Here, can't go that way anymore. Got to go this way. Keep going. Keep going. Come on, Ned. Move. Move. Thank God, it's all over. Jeez. I can get all the other stuff and we can get back into the house. And... Oh, yikes. Ned, you came all the way upstairs? Where... Where did you go? Ned. I hear you. Where are you at? Ned? Did he pass me on the steps? I thought I... he thought he passed me on the steps. Look at you! And now you awesome. You are now a cleric. <sighs> oh yeah, I guess we should uh oh no. I guess we should go. Uh, it's night out time. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh geez, oh crap. I need to get to a bed quickly. Quickly get to a bed before something bad. Uh but it's Oh shoot. Pardon me. Oh no, oh no, there's gonna be some bad guys out here somewhere. Uh, you guarding everything? Alright, well, you know, we're just gonna just go back to the house then. We're to the to the cave. We rescued Ned. We did our job. And now we can start to work on um I wanna go back there and clean up that bastion remnant because that that was a, a pain in the butt. And we will uh we will move on and go on to our next bit of things. It's 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 it's. I don't know how much we're gonna. I want to I want to get through all of the. Um, I want to get through all of the. Ouch! All the 1.16 stuff. I found some good things. I want to change out all the uh, lantern things with the uh, chains instead of having the um, the the fence posts and that would or the you know what I'm saying the wooden fences that would be great and then you know we'll, we'll do some more stuff and. Uh, we'll now, ahead. one of the things that really ticks me off is the fact that I had 42 levels going into that, uh, into the nether. And I do not have those 42 levels anymore it's because I died several times and I only got back four levels. However, uh, it's not the end of the world. I do have all of this here. All of this stuff here. I do. Is my. Did something happen to. Did something break on my, um. Excuse me, my cactus, cactus, uh, uh, I don't know, I didn't think it would have, I'd have to go check and see where the cactus stuff all goes, I'll have to do a look-see on that, because I thought all the cactus that would have been downstairs in the, uh, in the cactus farm would have, um, grow, or, you know, still been playing, maybe, did that get broken too? Is cactus fa farm no longer a thing anymore? Hmm. Okay, I figured out what was the problem. This, all of this, this here is where all of my, holy shit. Okay, I see what's happening here. I see what's happening here. Alright. This is where everything went wrong the hell. So I'm going to sit there and, and, and I'm going to pull all this stuff and then we will have uh, plenty of levels because we want to start trading with uh, Ned the Cleric and build up everything because we are going back into the nether and we are going to destroy everything that is down there and I'm going to use at my disposal all of my um oh geez all the things that are no longer well they're broken I can't use them anymore the way I liked to wow that was interesting um yeah I really gotta get the so now that we got the, the new the, the new wood and all that we can start really building this, I built this wall here to, 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 to keep this, and then, uh, you know, I want to put all my districts over there, my, like, you know, the garment district and all that other stuff, <laughs> which we may or may not get around to, can you know how that is? <laughs> yeah, it's sad. It really is kind of sad. But, um, with Ned, the, I gotta go, oh god, I gotta go, he'll end up back in the nether if I'm not careful. Hey, what's up, dude? 
Uh, so it looks like for now we're going to be back in the old texture pack, and we're going to be back playing in the old uh, in the old world for uh, for some time. We get some more things built and more things done, and uh, we'll go from there. But the uh, what I want to show you uh, since they broke the since 1.16 effectively broke. Not broke. Need to fix it. Ah, uh -huh. no. Since effectively got broke the um, this. Uh, here's all I got. This is all that I ended up getting. We can use some of these saddles on the striders. Uh, we got to get some more of the, you know, the warped. Um, what's this? Nether wart. Nether wart. Crimson fungus. We have to figure out how to make the warp stuff so we put it on a stick. And then get. But I get a luck of the sea, so that's good. Mending, unbreaking. Uh, okay, but what? This is the big thing here. Piercing, punch. Loyalty, th that must be for the uh, tridents. Tridents or orange. Like that. Knockback and sharpness, protection, efficiency, uh, Frostwalker, mending, and unbreaking three, Aqua, affinity, fortune two. This is going to have to be what we're going to use. We're going to uh, take, and I think I still have somewhere. I have to go look. I should have a uh, diamond, diamond pickaxe with something good on it. Uh, but we need, the reason why is because we're going to make the ultimate set of armor that will get us prepared for the fight to get back lag wherever he may be, because somebody bad has him. We just don't know who it is yet. But, uh, you know, if I can get the, uh, the, uh, the, the, the diamond pickaxe to have the best of stuff, stuff on it, we can go back down and clear out that Bastion Remnant. Uh, and go after... Oh, I really did not want them to... I screwed myself on this, didn't I? <laughs> I I did some I did some preparation. I kept finding the the golem at the bottom of the water, and, and I don't like, yeah, I don't know how I kept getting down there, but it was really bad. So, anyways, what I was trying to say was, when, once we get the the greatest of stuff on our pick our diamond pickaxe, we can go back into the Nether to start harvesting uh, ancient debris, so we can find Netherite, so we can build us a the best best suit of armor and best tools ever in the game now that uh, a, a netherite is a thing that's right that's right golem and we will uh we will we will then be ready to take on any foe that comes near us so stay tuned more's coming ned what ned ned watch out <laughs> That solves one problem. <laughs> <laughs> All right, come on, Ned. Let's go. That works that way. I'm gonna have to build some sort of a trip. Where did he go? Is he still here? Um, Ned, you shrunk.